And away we go. We're live. 27 people already in here waiting. Hello. Hello, everybody. How you guys doing? You guys okay? I don't know when it actually starts to be live. They're saying hi, so I think we're live now. We did it. We did it. We did it. There it goes. All right. So how's everybody doing? You guys okay? Yeah. How are you guys? We're good. It's uh it's been a little tough getting this together, but we did it. It's been a day. <laughs> okay, so have you guys heard of the saying when people say that Mercury is in retrograde? Do you guys believe in that? I feel like it's real. Yeah. Like we, we were just talking about it today and it, I think it's a real thing. Yeah. And one of the things that it does is it affects your like timing. Yeah. Like everything, if you try to plan something, it will not work out. Like if you do a big thing during this time period while it's in retrograde, it will have trouble with it for the rest of eternity. Like, <laughs> so, so we've been having a, a little bit of a time. Yeah. We've um, been having a day. Well, at least an evening. And then there was well, another then, another thing that we read about the Saturn's Revenge thing. Saturn's Revenge. I don't know if that's like I don't really understand that one because I don't know if I had a terrible time when I turned twenty nine, which I guess is when it oh, happens. Oh yeah, yeah. That was. I don't know, but I, definitely the retrograde Mercury thing is real. Somebody said, "Oh, somebody said, are you drinking tea?" I am drinking tea. Oh, well, <laughs> so um, we got like a boatload of mail. I don't know what happened this week that we got just like a, a lot of mail. Yeah. Uh, so unfortunately we have to, we don't have that much time tonight. No, that was the other thing is that <laughs> we, we were having a hard time getting this all set up, that it took us like an hour. So um, now we only have an hour to do the mail vlog. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to, it sounds like your whole life. Oh no. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I hope that, that it is not your whole life. And I hope it's just until April 15th, which is when, yeah. Mercury is not in retrograde anymore, I guess. Yeah, it like comes out of its shadow. I don't know what that means. I have but... no idea. But apparently it's all going to end on April 15th, and that's when everybody will be able to plan things again, and everything will be wonderful again. Yeah, you'll be, you'll be good to go. <laughs> so we'll Please. keep our fingers crossed for you, Angela. Okay, good. Um, oh, thank you. Some... Oh, sorry. Oh, somebody asked how Baby Bean was. He's sleeping like, yeah, right there. he's on the ground right here. Oh, thank you, Melissa. She said that my voiceover vlog was awesome. Yeah, it was pretty really <laughs> funny. I liked it. I just was, I was putting the footage in the computer and I'm like, I'm doing something wrong. Like, what did I do? What, what's going on here? And I, I did it like over and over and over again and tried to like close out of it, you know, turn it off, turn it back on again, whatever. Nothing worked. Huh. So I had to do a quick voiceover and try to fix it because it was, I needed that clip for the other clip to make sense. Right. <laughs> so... I'm glad you guys liked it though. Thank you. Um. So, where's the football? What football? I don't know. They put a they put an emoji of a volleyball. Oh. And asked about the football. I like it. <laughs> what do you think of Disney hotels charging for parking? Every other hotel already did that. Like yeah. at, at, whenever we stayed at any other hotel, like for. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my gosh, I burped in the mail blog. Well, no, oh, no, I have to tweet out the link for the mail blog. Oh shoot. I totally forgot about that. Um, but yeah, every other every other hotel did. Um, Universal, all of those hotels already charged. Any hotel that we stayed off property, like when we stayed at um, where did we stay? Uh, Hilton's. It was like a Hilton or something. Yeah. Those always charge for parking, so we just. I don't know. I don't think it's that big of a deal. April in Florida dress code. It's going to be hot. So I would oh, say yeah. bring your summer clothes. Hello. Uh, Desiree said, I work at Turf Club at Saratoga Springs. Please come and eat tomorrow. Oh, I think tomorrow we're going to try to check out the Ant and Deck stuff. So we won't be at Disney tomorrow. We'll be um, at, like in the Universal area tomorrow. Yeah. So... Um, we won't, I'm sorry, but we hope that you have an awesome time. I'm almost done, I promise. I'm not ignoring you guys. Oh, no. Um, oh, no, I hope you feel better. I felt bad last night. Why? I don't understand why. Because of Mercury's in retrograde. Oh, yeah. That's For true. real, I really think that's what it is. It's just like this weird, 
I don't know. It's like it drains your energy. Yeah. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like I have the flu, but I don't have the flu. Is the mustache coming back? I mean, I ha- it's there. It's there. But I, I don't know if I'll shave it back into it. I got on Fury 325 five times last weekend. That's a lot. That is a lot. Yeah. It was nice to see you guys in something other than t-shirts yesterday. Well, oh, thank we, you. We were in our clothes. Oh, yeah. Sorry. We're just really casual people. We're so we don't. Super casual. We really are. We're not very dressy or very fancy at all. Um, but it was nice to like wear cool clothes <clears throat> that were. Yeah, it's nice. Let me ask you guys something. What? So today we have a ton of mail. And that means that there will be less interacting with you guys in the mail blog, more with us interacting with the mail. What do you guys prefer? Would you guys prefer us opening up mail? Or do you guys prefer us interacting with the chat? That's the question. Well, I think that people probably like to hear us read their mail. Yeah, But I I know that some people don't like to hear us read other people's mail because I've read those comments too. So it's like, is there a way for us to read the mail on our own, which we do, just to make sure there's nothing like weird or anything like that. Um, But like, just do like a quick summary of it for you guys. Yeah. Does that make sense? Everybody keeps saying both. That's what there's the both yeah. is not the choice. It's hard to uh, it's it's hard to do both. It really is. Two different live videos. We can barely do one live video a week. Know. We're always postponing it and missing it. So I'd hate to say, yeah, we're gonna do two, and then we never do two because I think that's probably what would happen. Right. There, I wish that like I know it. I know it's. I don't know how to say it. Like it probably doesn't seem like we're super busy, but we are all the time. <laughs> so it's hard to, it's, true. it's hard to, um, and do a daily video. It's just, it's really a lot. So I'd hate to like say, yeah, we'll do two. I know we can't do two. I wish we Man, could. this is, I'm going to have to do a Twitter poll, I think, because there's, it's, it's all over the place. It's back and forth. Oh no. So much. <laughs> <clears throat> Ashley says, wanted, wanted you guys to know that I watched your old blogs about buying a house. And it oh, helped during my home buying process. That's awesome. That's amazing. Congrats on buying a house. It's like the most stressful, awesome time. Yeah. Um, and when it's over, it's nice that it's over. <laughs> Expedition Theme Park just sent us a heart. Thank you. Thank you. Hearts back to you. Adam Park says, I'll be watching the Ant and Deck here in the UK at 7 p.m. Yay. That's um, really cool. So wait, what time is it for us? Two. So it's like a live thing, right? Two o'clock, yeah. Okay. Do you uh, know when Fast and Furious is opening at Universal? Coming in May. Hope to ride it. Is Universal yeah. busy during Cinco de Mayo? Um, it'll probably be busy just because it'll be May, but I don't think that the Fast and Furious ride is going to be like super busy. Yeah. I, I, I'd but be it's really, new, so it might be. Maybe like the first week, but I don't think it's going to be like a super busy ride all the time. Right. Do you? No. I don't know. I no, because because Jimmy Fallon's not a super busy ride all the time. Though. But Jimmy Fallon is not like a global brand. Right. Like people in other countries don't know who he is and don't like him. So like for us, we're like, oh, cool, Jimmy Fallon. But so I wonder if Fast and Furious, that's a global brand, right? Like because they had the one movie in Japan. Yeah. And they, they do, don't, don't they do the movies in other countries and stuff? Yeah. Okay. So maybe it'll be big. I don't know. Uh. Parnell says, quick Periscope daily. Uh, whoa, no. oh, man. We can't. I have a hard enough time getting a video out. <laughs> I'm sorry. Day. Um, we used to use Periscope, though, and the it's like the Wi-Fi. If the Wi-Fi is bad at all, it's a really terrible signal, and then it's just annoying to watch. Right. So we stopped using it just because it's kind of a bad platform. Um, Paul wants to know what our thoughts are on Blue Man Group. I love it. We have two, I think, at least two videos, right, of Blue Man Group? Yeah. Because we have the old show, and then they had, like, a a refresh, like, new show. And um, I really liked them both. And they have a sensory-friendly show that they do. I think they do it once a year, or maybe more than that. I think they do it once a month. Do they? Yeah, I'll have to look it up. Okay, but and I think that's really neat that they do that. Um, Are you going to Dapper Day at Magic Kingdom? No. I might go, but I'm not going to dress up. Okay. I don't know, though. I don't even know when it is. When is it? I don't know. <laughs> Keeping up with the trackers. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, are you going to Volcano Bay at the end of this month? Because I'll be there on the 28th. 
I don't know. The weather is getting nicer, so it'll be a it'll be a good time to go soon for sure. Uh, somebody, Catherine says she can't hear us. Can uh -huh. everybody hear us? I mean, we're people are asking, and nobody else has said that. That's so weird. I don't know. I don't know. Sarah says, "Can you wish my daughter Clara happy birthday? Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Clara!" Clara. Uh, they're planning a trip for June to Walt Disney World. Everybody says they can hear us. Oh, good. Okay, cool. Perfectly. People said perfectly. Oh, no. Well, we hope you have an awesome trip in June. Naomi said, shout out to Naomi, Georgie, Charlotte, and Lewis. Shout out to Lewis. Ryan's watching us from Disneyland. Oh, that's awesome. We got a letter from you, Ryan. Thank oh, yeah, you. we did. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so here, we should read some of these now. Yeah. Um, Are these the ones that we're starting with? Yeah. Okay. I got these open and those open. Okay. So these are the quick ones. Do you want to read one of those? Yeah. Okay. Cool. This one is from Christina. And there's a, uh, what is this? Oh. The, what is the Stone Pony. Oh. I don't know what that is. That's, I guess, in New Jersey. New Jersey. Um. Not good with these things, so hi, big fan. Love all of your vlogs. They always make my day and watch all of your adventures in Disney and everywhere or anywhere you go. Your trips during Halloween Horror Nights are always the best. Excuse me. Oh, no. <laughs> I have a uh, Best to watch, especially the one where the usher took your camera. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. So far, the Mardi Gras made me laugh. I wish you didn't shave the stash. Oh, no, it's growing back. Keep up your good work, fam, dab. <laughs> she dab. Uh, awesome. Mickey ears, mustache, Disney from Christina H. Thank you. Thank you. Thank yeah, you so much. We appreciate it. Okay, I think I did that wrong. I think we need to what? do, uh, we'll just say, we'll, we'll kind of abbreviate them. Yeah, that's what I thought you were okay, going to do. Sorry, I messed up. Well, you didn't mess up. Sorry. <laughs> Mercury retrograde. That's what it is. Um, we get asked, we're getting asked a bunch of where if we'll do a Disney cruise. And I feel like we get this question of like a hundred times a, a, every live show. Um, I don't know. Yeah. I'm, a, I'm really afraid of cruises. Like I'm really afraid of them. So I just don't, it doesn't sound fun to me. Right. I've been on a Disney cruise and it was when I was like 15 years old. It was forever ago, but I just, you know how sometimes when you get older, you become afraid of things. Cause me, that's what I did. Oh. <laughs> I became afraid of cruises. So when is Toy Story opening? June 30th. Yeah. Uh, oh, and then, okay. So also another question we've been getting a lot too is this more universal stuff. And so the reason why I actually wanted to talk about this in the blog the other day, and then I, I, we just never got around to it, but it's like math, right? So Disney has six parks, right? They literally have six parks that we can go to locally and I think and Disney Springs, right? Yeah. And I think 28 resorts, right? Well, I'm just talking about the parks. Yeah. Okay. So we're, let's say that's seven things that we can do Disney, like, like for an entire day, seven different Disney things. Universal only has three parks. Right. <laughs> and, and then city walk, which we don't really hang out in city walk all that often, but they are like sort of giving it a facelift. Like it's getting a little upgrade. Yeah. So I think maybe we'll hang out in city walk more often, maybe. But so it's really, if you think about it, it's just math. Like, yeah. there's more Disney <clears throat> stuff to do, so we're going to do more Disney stuff. Right. But there are lots of things opening at Universal. So, like, Voodoo Donuts just opened. Fast and Furious is going to open. Something else. Yeah. And oh, Horror Nights is coming. And we're kind of in a lull at Universal right yeah, now. Yeah, like, there's nothing really going on at Universal. Right. But we, we still believe that we're going to get um nintendo yeah so as soon as that starts construction i'll be out there showing off the construction of nintendo like yeah. i am for hollywood studios yeah yeah and like once we can start to see some stuff for the harry potter coaster right now you can't really see anything yeah like i feel like every time we go we're just like it's back there I promise yeah. you can't see it but it's back there so i think that's why we're kind of like but we can definitely go um for like a park day it yeah. just it won't be like really an update type video. There won't be any new information because there isn't really any new information right now. Mm -hmm. So that's all. I just wanted to explain that in a video and I never got a chance to. That it's it's not that we like like one more than the other. There's just more going on at Disney. So that's all. What is your uh Voodoo Donuts? Yes. Yes. <laughs> um all right. So this next one is from Katie. And Katie drew us on the bottom and it's very cute. Let me show you. And we're vlogging. 
I don't know, where's the camera? There? Yeah, like right in the center. There we are. Look, I even have my bun on. Nice. <laughs> Uh, Katie is writing from New York. It's very cold. She's a fan of Disney World. She loves our vids. Um, oh, they love to watch us. And if this is being read on a mail vlog, shout out to Katie. Shout out to Katie. And to Carly, her big sister. Shout out to Carly. I think Carly sent us a letter, too. Katie and Carly. Maybe not. Oh. Maybe that was a different family. Um, can you do a video on the opening day of Toy Story Land? And I think we definitely are, are going to try to do that. Yeah. Um, it's probably going to be... Bandit. Oh, no, he hit the camera. He hit the camera. Is everything okay? Sorry. That was a bandit earthquake. Are you okay? Just so you guys know. What's wrong? He wanted to be closer to us, but there was, like, too much stuff oh. in between us and him. He's I, like... I think we need to, like... Um, I think what we need to do is we need to figure out a place where Bandit can have a bed in here. Yeah. Because he wants to be in here with us. He just... He doesn't fit on this couch. So. Right. Bandit um, quake. Oh, no. Uh, and... So, and she's going in August, and so she wanted to see a preview, which we can definitely do that for you. And she's king of the bus. King of the bus. Time to pay the price. And and then she drew a photo of us. So thank you so much to Katie and Carly. We really appreciate you sending us a letter. Yeah, thank Can you. I put this down here? Yeah, okay. perfect. Cool. Uh, Zorant says, hello from Nova Scotia. Love your videos and watch you every day. Won't be back to Disney and Universal for another year and a half. Hope to meet you at the parks. Thank you. If you see us, be sure to say hello. Yeah. Um, and Alex says, greetings from Ohio. Headed to Universal soon. Best place for dinner at City Walk. And then thoughts about Stranger Things at HHN. I like Antihitos a yeah. lot. Red Oven's good. Yeah. Cowfish is good for the most part. When cowfish is good, it's really good. But when it's bad, it's terrible. And I would never want anybody to go there when it's bad. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like it's not consistent enough. Bread box is good. Yeah. Uh, I feel like some of the stuff that we got at at Tucson was good, too. Oh, yeah. I like Tucson. It, it was kind of like some of the stuff that had chocolate in it was weird. Yeah. But some of it was good. Their tachos are amazing. Yeah, I did like those. I forgot about the tachos. Yeah. Uh, and Stranger Things, pumped, love yeah, it, can't really wait, super, super excited. excited. It's going to be busy, and I think ticket prices are going to go up this year because of it. Um, Ding dang. That's okay, I guess. That's okay, <laughs> I guess. This one is from I... Katrina, I think. Oh, Kaylee. Okay. Oh, Kaylee. Yeah, hold this one up for them. Okay. Uh, oh. She recently moved to Florida, and she's hoping to see us. Wait, can you see said, it? Is yeah. That good? Okay. She said, sorry, the hairdo is outdated. Oh, no. But I hope you like it. Could you shout out Kaylee's Adventures on YouTube? Um, oh, no. Her mom was frustrated at when I, when we went to the outlets. They had to go later the day, later oh. that day. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, thank you so much, Kaylee. Yeah. And thank you for the drawing, too. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's very cute. Okay. Uh, oh, angry commenter is new to this new to the stream. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't be angry in our stream. Um, okay, so this next one is from the midwife mom, and she's just giving us an update about her. Oh no, that was me. I hit the computer, oh. not the camera. Okay, so she's giving us an update about all of her um, where she lives, how it's been raining. She has a wolfhound that likes to. Sleep in the middle of the yard when it's raining. Hmm. Oh, well, that sounds interesting. It does, yeah. Uh, somebody was talking about how we kick with our toes for, for foot golf. I know. I'm we did sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that we did that. My foot really hurts, by the way. You guys yeah. were right. It, we do have sore toes. Um, so then she was also saying that she's going to have to get carpal tunnel surgery, which oh, no. stinks. Yeah, that's terrible. Um Dang, I hope you I hope you get the surgery and I hope that it like relieves the pain, you know? I hope um, so too. What are your thoughts on the new uh, Universal hotels? I love them. They look so awesome and they're going to be uh, relatively inexpensive. So I think one of them starts at $77 and the other one's 111. 
Oh, and they look really nice too. Yeah. So she's giving us our virtual gifts. Um, she said, cause we asked for no, like no packages cause we were running out of space for things. And so she's been giving us virtual gifts for a couple of weeks now. So she said that Bandit gets a big bone to chew on. Oh. I get a two hour massage. Oh, I need that too. Yeah. And then you get a ride on the next shuttle launch. Oh. Yeah, so you're going to be an astronaut. Well, that sounds frightening. <laughs> so thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Um, Shout out to Concierge Joe. Oh, I got ooh. these over here. Okay. Shout out to Jesky. Did we ever finish the bathroom? We did not finish the bathroom. No. We need to do that, though. I'll switch with me, actually. Oh, okay. Oh, this is fun. Yeah. Oh, okay. This one is from Pink Pearl. Says this is my first, probably only time I will write. I don't write much. I'm shy. Oh. Uh, I love your vids. Hope these help. And they sent over a bunch of coupons for stuff around the Disney area. Oh. So oh like, my gosh. A uh, free kids meal at Wolfgang Pucks. Twenty percent off Javianas. What is this from? I don't know, but there's what's that? What's that one right there? This one is for Hilton Head. Oh, it must be a DVC coupon oh, thing because they see. got coupons for oh. Dang it. No, it's for a different color. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, free yeah. same-day replay. Dang, that's pretty cool. Thank you. Would you be interested in visiting Fiesta Texas Six Flags? It's themed DC Comics and Looney Tunes. Isn't that the one that got the Joker ride that we saw at IAPA? I think so. The Joker like, had like that cool Joker um, animatronic guy? I, I think so. Yeah, I'd love to do that. That sounds amazing. Um, man, That was from The Hunter's Wife. Oh. Mandy says, hi, guys. Love from Prince Edward Island tonight. Jen, love seeing you in so many videos again. Thank you. You both look great. Avengers or Solo, which movie are you most excited for? <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not like a. She's excited for <laughs> Avengers because it's got oh, the Black, Black Panther. Panther in yeah, it. yeah. The Black Panther. The Black Panther. I am excited for Avengers, but I don't, I'm not really excited for Avengers because yeah. I'm. I am, but I'm not. I need to watch the rest of them because I don't know what's going on really. <laughs> I think it's it's kind of self-explanatory, right? Do you know what I'm excited for? Like the movie that I'm most excited to see is actually A Quiet Place. Oh, I heard so many reviews of that. Yeah, and I don't want to be spoiled. I I like didn't even watch my movie review guy. They said that um, because it's it's quiet movie. Everybody's silent. Yeah. They said that any noise that's in the movie theater can be heard by the entire movie theater. They said that people were trying their hardest to like open up their candy packages as quiet as possible <laughs> and like chew their popcorn as quiet as possible. Oh no. <laughs> Man, I want to see it in the movie theater, but I hate going to the movie theater. I don't want to see it in the movie theater because I, I hate going to the movie theater. Yeah. I'll I just wanna, watch it at home. I want to be there like without, with. I want to find a group of people that are like, we go to the movies, we don't use our cell phone. We don't talk. We don't sneeze. But we have sneeze, to we we don't find snore. like 200 people. Yeah. Because nobody else can come in the movie theater. Only only the people that have good etiquette. Right. Which is this group. Yeah. That's, so that was basically like 200. what happened and the Alamo Draft House started it. Oh, really? Like that's the Alamo Draft House does that. Oh. Like if, if you talk, if you pull out your cell phone, there's like a guy in the theater that comes over and kicks you out. Good. Yeah. Because you know what? That was the most annoying thing during Black Panther was... The guy snoring? Well, the guy snoring <laughs> was annoying, for sure. But there was a girl, or a person, I don't know if it was a girl, but it was a person that would just kept pulling their phone out, and it was so bright. Yeah. And there was even a thing, I didn't even know they did this, but before the movie, there was a thing that came on that was like, don't pull your phone out. Yeah. Like, don't even, just put it on silent, but also put it away. I like, I'm so nervous about it. I put my phone on theater mode because it's like, or my oh, yeah, watch, watch because too. it's bright. Yeah, me too. So, hmm. How's Infinity Falls coming? I got to go check it out again. I haven't been back in a while. Yeah. Is the Central Island still at Caribbean Beach Resort? Yes. Is that the island that has all of the... Uh, Probably cannons and stuff on it. But it has like the hammocks around it too? Uh, the hammocks are on the, the beach side. Oh, uh, okay. But there is, there's an island there. I show it just like barely when i'm saying like we're looking here we're gonna walk across there i'm right next to the island in the video when i say that oh okay gotcha um let's see here can you say hi to leah's or lee sorry not leah lee <laughs> we want to say hi to your mom michaela oh because uh Hi, Michaela. oh mom equals number one fan thank you for watching we love you michaela 
Hi, it's Stuart and my fiance Brittany. We met you at Hollywood Studios and it made oh my my fiance Brittany met you at Hollywood Studios and it made her day. Two questions. What's the best donut place in Orlando? Ooh. Are the Hollywood mansion rumors true about the change to Coco? That is one hundred percent not true. Who keeps coming up with these silly rumors? Somebody said it was Haunted Mansion. I don't know why anybody would imagine that a wildly popular ride well, like Haunted Mansion. If anything's going to be Coco, it's going to be the Grand Fiesta Tour. Yeah, Grand but Fiesta it's Tour. Not like, and we're not saying that that's a thing, but I'm just saying that if that were to ever be a thing, the only thing that makes sense would be Grand Fiesta Tour. Yeah. Like, why would they ruin... I mean, not that it would ruin Haunted Mansion, but you'd have to change... It would completely change it. Yeah. And there are, like, it has its own merch line. It has its own store. It has that, like, that movie, the Eddie Murphy movie? It has that Eddie Murphy movie? <laughs> I think that what it is is certain news sources, like... They maybe, run with anything is what it is. Well, I think they're they're like, what'll get clicks? What who will, yeah. What'll get people watching is if we just make these ridiculous things up. Yeah. And then they're like, oh, just a rumor. <laughs> there, there so, is I don't know. Zero percent chance. No, I would be like so shocked. And I, I will, I will, I will stake my reputation on it. There is zero percent chance. What if they do it? They're not doing it. What if they do? You can't, you can't be so bold. Okay, I, here's the thing: Mercury's in retrograde, so let's not get crazy. Okay. Okay. Yeah, sorry, Mercury retrograde. <laughs> um, it's not happening. Okay. Um, will you be What's reviewing... What's the point we need to take oh. with the best donut places? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I haven't eaten... Honestly, I really eat Krispy donuts. Kreme. I would say Krispy Kreme. Yeah. Those are delicious. They're always good. They're not thick. Somebody said, did you hear about Small World changing? What is Small World changing to? Coco. Coco. No, what is it, though? What do they say? It's another wildly popular bride. But who... I feel like if they changed that, Walt would be... You know, when, will, you know when Mary people, Blair will come well, back. You know how people are like Walt would be rolling in his grave, and really it's like you know he wouldn't. You don't know him. He's I'm sure he'd be fine with it. But I think with Small World, he really would be rolling in his grave. Yeah, I think that would be a real thing. That was like yeah, oh man, Sherman Brothers too. Oh They'd yeah, be so upset. Everybody, <laughs> Zombie Walt, come back from the dead. <laughs> will we be at the Animal Kingdom anniversary? We yes. will. Yes, we will yes, be there. Will. Um. Uh, we'll we really JD, oh my gosh what <laughs> um esteban said that they spent a hundred dollars on popcorn because of our vlog oh well, no can i just tell you same what popcorn when we had all that popcorn oh yeah and we're still eating it like i've gained probably six or seven pounds from eating all that popcorn. too much popcorn <laughs> yeah. uh jb says we really enjoy your daily videos but i'm looking forward to seeing universal resort tours and hhn me too yeah we're excited and i just finalized some information with universal orlando mm -hmm. and we have uh room tours oh yay that's exciting so we are good to go we will start doing uh resort tours very soon yeah i'm excited that we're actually going to get to show you the rooms as well because i know that really helps for the um touring you know and planning and stuff what? i always i always think it's funny when like somebody just said when are you guys coming to canada like i don't uh... know <laughs> I'm not sure. I really like the sunshine and the warmth. So yeah, when it's is, still when, snowing in Canada right now, right? Yeah. When is Canada warm? We'll be there then. Oh man. <laughs> uh, Audrey, thank you, Audrey, so much. We really appreciate it. Uh, R. John says Resort TV just showed us on their live stream. Oh, oh cool. well, thank you. Hi, Resort TV. How, what does that mean? What did they? they I think they just showed our live stream on their live stream. Oh, like they were watching it. oh, that's cool. Well, thank you. We appreciate that. That's oh, awesome. Man. Um, Corey said, started my own channel. You're a big inspiration. Thank you. Well, that's awesome. Thank you for starting or for, um, thank you. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. We're glad that we can be your inspiration. I just did that thing where you, somebody like when you go somewhere and you go, they go have fun and they're like working and you go, yeah, you have fun. And you're like, what, why? Yeah. You know what I mean? And then you go crawl into a, into a <laughs> And you're cave. like, ah. <laughs> Tyler says, do you ever go to Walmart? Uh, no, no, we don't. There was on Easter, I had to go to the grocery store and I thought for a split second that I was going to have to go to Walmart and I was uh, not going to do it. No, I was going to change my whole plans for the day. Yeah. It's like so hectic and so chaotic. It's just too much. It's too much for me. Also, when I was younger, it like. There's a weird fuzzy ticking noise in the background. Oh, it's, is it this? It might be this. Yeah, there's like, it's, it's, I need to mount it to the wall. It's like moving up and down back here. Oh, gotcha. 
Um, when I was younger, like senior in, in high school, freshman in college, mm -hmm. we used to just go and hang out at Walmart because it was open 24 hours. But, so like at 2 a.m., we're just like roaming around Walmart. I got my fix of Walmart. I'm good to go. Yeah. Don't need to go back to Walmart ever again. <laughs> and thank you, Herschel. Um, okay, so let me do this one. From Karen, do you think we need to turn a light on? Oh, I can do this. Is, Is it that better? better? Okay, cool. Um, so Karen says uh, they were down in October of last year for the Halloween party. Um, they're coming back for the Christmas party this year. Wanted to go to the Disney warehouse, oh. um, but will not be able to. Oh, okay. So they wanted to go to the Disney warehouse or Disney Springs. Won't be able to do both. Which one would be better? Oh. Okay. That's a tough question because Disney, if you're only going for souvenirs, like Disney souvenirs. Right. And you don't care about anything but the souvenirs, I would like say. eating. Yeah. Because there's no, no good food or anything at the outlet. Um, and the outlet itself <laughs> is terrible. Like. The only good thing is the Disney outlet. What? So he goes, when are you guys coming to the whale or when are you guys coming to Wales? Okay. <laughs> um, so I would say if you're just going for cheap souvenirs, go to the outlet. But if you want like a day to like do stuff and eat at delicious places and like see lots of Disney things, I would say go to Disney Springs. If it were me personally, I would go to Disney Springs. Yeah. Cause there's just, that's more, there's much more to do there. Yeah. Well, That's just me. Real quick, wanted to give a birthday shout out to Jace. Yeah. Happy seventh birthday, Jace. Oh, happy birthday. Yeah, yeah, hope you're having a great day. Yeah. About three t-shirts. Okay, so I actually thought about that because the about symbol is just like a wavy, like a wavy um, equal sign. That's like a, yeah, approximately equal to yeah. three. Yeah. I like that. That is, no, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> um, ooh, all right. I am saying. Did that. anybody else catch that? <laughs> no. Please, please ignore. I'm okay. So they're going to stay at All Star Movies, and they wanted to play mini golf. Um, have we played the Blizzard Beach one? We have played it, and I don't actually think we ever put that video out. We didn't ever put out. We put out. Um, no, we never put out Winter Summerland. We oh. put out Fantasy. Well, yeah, this is the one she's Fantasia. they're talking about. Yeah, so we didn't actually we did do it, but we never put the video out. We so go yes, do that. it was nice. It was a good time. Um, I think they're both great though. Both of those courses are really fun. Yeah. Um, do you know how long a fuel rod lasts? It is just like I think it's it's like three quarters of a charge. Yeah, it's not a full battery charge. And then how long it takes to charge? So you don't actually have to charge it at all. You take your empty fuel rod and you put it in the machine and it just gives you another one. Yeah. You're literally But you just... can still charge it. Like if you're at home, you can charge it. Oh, I don't know how long it takes though. Just like a normal yeah. one. I don't know. Yeah. But what I if I were you, I would just literally exchange it for the fully charged one so you don't have to worry about it. Come to America, um, please. The, <laughs> and the best place to get one is I would say online because it's cheaper than in the park or at the airport because it's cheaper than in the park. It's thirty dollars in the park and twenty dollars online in the airport. Yeah, it's so it's twenty dollars uh, online, but you pay five dollars shipping. Oh, so then if you can get it at the you airport, you get it at the airport or it's, any place other than Disney. Yeah, um, keep missing your live show when you do them. Great work. I hope the do a fast pass for Slinky Dog Coaster. Can't wait to see you ride yeah. it. Well, thank you, Karen. We really appreciate this, and um, we hope you have an awesome time at the Christmas party. You're gonna love it. People just started making their. Uh, 90 day fast passes. Oh, did they? Yeah. So if you are staying club level at a Disney resort and you pay the extra $50 for the six fast passes a day, mm -hmm. you can make your reservations now. Oh, wow. And um, all of the Toy Story Land things moved up into tier one. Oh, oh she's petting Bandit. Sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Bandit was down there. Little baby boo. Yeah. Um, looking good. Uh, the electric ballroom says, "Looking good without the stash." Jen always looks good. Oh well, thank you. Uh, I don't feel like I always look good, so I really appreciate that. I think you always look good. <laughs> Even like today, I think what it is is especially during the live show, I'm always running behind because today is the only day that I have to do 
like laundry. Mercury retrograde. Oh yeah, no, yeah. But I'm always running behind even when Mercury isn't in retrograde because today's like my one day around the house to get things done. Yeah. So I either have time to do my makeup or my hair and today I didn't have time to do either. <laughs> so I appreciate the nice words. Thank you guys. The Cubats, is there a good resort outside of Disney that offers buses to Disney and Universal? There are so many resorts that, that offer offer buses. Yeah, that offer oh, buses. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, they do have all have the shuttle thing. There are a lot, and I don't. We haven't stayed at enough of them or visited enough of them to give you a good recommendation. Um, the only one that we stayed at that was technically off Disney property, but still sort of near Disney, was the Hilton at Bonnet Creek, and that was nice. Shuttle? I don't know. I think they did. I feel like they did have a shuttle too, because I kind of remember. What's that? Disney just tweet. Oh, there it goes. Oh, that was weird. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh. What? Something new is coming to Pandora, the world of Avatar, starting April 22nd. Ooh. Check the Disney Parks blog Saturday at 9 a.m. for full details. What is it? I don't know. So we have Disney on notification because they do um, like social meetups sometimes, and you have to be like, you have to be one of the first, second people to do it. So, um, Oh, what is it? It's like a walk around guy. Oh, in a big giant like exoskeleton suit. Can you show the camera? All right. Sorry, my nose started running. Oh. Can you guys see that? Uh, so reflectively. You guys see him? He looks pretty cool, right? Do you have to yeah, I don't know. Wow. You guys just go on Twitter. You can see it. <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah, real avatars. Yeah. Um, do you like Bubba Gump's? I think that you can get better seafood in City Walk. Yeah. But I but it's not bad. You know what I mean? What? Sometimes I do this. It feels nice. <laughs> um, isn't that standing stationary in Pandora? It was not that exact thing. I bet they'll still have that that other yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah. So this is like a different color um suit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Packing for Orlando now. Yeah. Oh, Chris Pratt. Yeah. We'll see you soon. That's exciting. Uh, will you ever do another Justin Scard collab? And that's, that's hard. I don't, I don't know. He's like, every time that he's in here, we're like not in the right, not in the same city. Or when we went to California last time. He was in Paris. Yeah. So we're just never in the same area. Plus he doesn't live here and we don't yeah. live there. So it's very hard. And whenever he comes here, he's filming like. 500 videos a day well plus he's here with like his girlfriend too so it's not like you know like they're on vacation yeah i don't know it's it's such a weird thing when people who don't live here come here and then people are like go go collab with them like go meet up with them go hang out with them and sometimes what you guys don't know is that they don't want that like they're on vacation yeah you know like they're not trying to i don't know so so yeah <laughs> Brandon says, thank you so much for everything you do. You are my favorite TV show without question. What's the best way we can help support the channel? Thank you. Just by watching the videos. Yeah, honestly, that really is like the best thing. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, please say like, hello to... Oh, I missed it. Where was it? Shout out to T. T! Um, we do have, well, no, I have a Snapchat, but I don't really use it anymore because I don't really like the new update. Um, I can't use any filters. It won't let me use any filters anymore. So I haven't been using it. I'm sorry. What's your earliest Disney memory? My earliest Disney memory is when they used to have, um, near the thing where you put your hands and your head in the holes, you know? Yeah. There used to be a playground there. Oh. And that's my, like my first memory is like playing in the playground over there. Hmm. Not like right there, but like somewhere in that area, there used to be like a playground. Are you thinking of over by Splash Mountain? Is that where it was? It's still there. No, I have a picture of it. Oh, okay. I'll yeah. look at it and we'll see. Yeah. Um, I have a terrible memory, oh, no. so I don't actually have any memories. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no. Uh, oh no, the, the, the chat's going very fast. Oh yeah, I miss Honey, I Shrunk the Kids too. This one is from Josh. They're celebrating their first anniversary in Orlando. Oh, that's exciting. They're making a video of their last year together. Oh. You both have brought happiness and excitement to build up to our vacation. I was hoping you could send a five second, oh. 
uh, okay, sorry. There was a personal thing at the end there that I started reading, but uh, yeah. All right. So thank you, Josh. Thank you for the card. And congratulations on one year together. Yeah. I like how the thing is like pointing at you. So I wonder if like. What? Boy band question. In sync or Backstreet Boys and why? So wait, really quick. Here's what we'll do. Um, we They want us to send them a clip, but what we'll do is we'll do it right here. And if you guys are watching, um, you can hopefully take it from this video. Yeah. So we just wanted to wish, did we tell us her name? Well, no. Um, wait. They didn't. Oh, no. We don't know her name. Oh, no. Well, happy anniversary. Uh, so we just wanted to say, uh, hold on, wait. Josh? <laughs> we don't know her name. Oh, no. I'm sorry. We just wanted to say happy anniversary, though. We hope you guys had a fantastic first year. Yeah, and yeah. congratulations. Yeah, congrats. And eat that cake that you've had frozen for a full year now. <laughs> did we ever eat our cake? Yeah. It was oh, bad. yeah, we did. Oh, yeah, it was bad. Um, okay, so this next one is from Lindsay, and they're from Virginia. Um, her and her husband, Joey, started watching, um, doesn't say when, but they got hooked. They became hooked. So now they have to wait and watch them together, and they usually watch while they're eating dinner, which I think is really cool. A lot of the people that we meet um, say that they watch as a family, like, while they're oh, eating yeah. dinner and stuff, and I think that's actually very cool. That is very cool. I really like that. <laughs> oh, no. Good night, Ireland. Good night. I uh, love Jen's hair color. Me too. Thank you. It's actually a lot uh, darker and brighter. I know that sounds weird, but in the sunshine, it is really bright. Oh, yeah. Than I thought it was going to be. And so I'm hoping that it fades a little bit, <laughs> um, which I think it will in the sun and stuff. Somebody was wondering where I got my Lost Boy shirt from shopdisney.com. Yeah, it was cool. Uh, will there be a soft opening at Toy Story Land? I don't know. There doesn't have to be, but... Oh, this is so cool. It, there could be. So Joey was turning 30, and they came to Disney. And he was, like, bummed to be turning 30. Oh, no. Which, by the way, 30 was, like, my best year. Was it? Yeah, it was, like, when we bought our house. Nice. And all that stuff. Yeah, it was, like, a good... 30s are good. So <laughs> um, so she surprised him with, like, all the things that he's always wanted to do. Oh, so nice. they stayed at club level at the Animal Kingdom Lodge. Nice. They ordered the Pluto cake from Amaretz. Um, they went, they did the keys to the kingdom tour. They went to see Lanuba. Wow. Um, and it looks like they do silks too. So like yeah. them getting to see Lanuba would probably be pretty awesome. This is really cool. This is them actually. Let me see if I can. Or aerial silks. Is that what they're called? I don't know. It looks really neat, but that's them like doing the silks. Yeah. Pretty awesome. That's so cool. Last year they were they did Trusting Me from the Jungle Book, the Scarlett Johansson version. That's oh. what they did on their like for their routine. And then Tim, I remember you mentioned in a video that you have an eyelid that droops. So do I. I've always been so self conscious about it, but hearing you mention it in passing makes me feel better. I talked to my eye doctor about surgery to correct it, but I don't want to do that. Oh. Oh, well, see, it's really? a normal thing. And so she actually curls her at her eyelashes. He. On her. No, it's her. Lindsay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, curls eyelashes on that side, which helps. So you should oh, curl your eyelashes. I'll have to curl my eyelashes. Your yeah. eyelashes are so straight. Like mine do the same thing, but they literally, his lashes just go like this. <laughs> These are my eyelashes. <laughs> For real. So it might be hard, but that's a really good idea. Um, well, thank you so much. We really appreciate you sending the letter and, oh, no. um, oh gosh, bandit. That's bandit. He's that's moving bandit. everything around. Um, just so you guys know, anytime there's an earthquake, it's always bandit. It's bandit. But thank you both so much for watching, and we really appreciate it. And um, and we yeah, thank you for sending the letter. It's awesome. Uh, so we never answered our boy band question. What was the question? In sync or Backstreet Boys, and why? Oh, that's hard. Yeah, it's not hard for me. I want to say Backstreet Boys. I I wanted that way. Yeah. <laughs> was that Backstreet Boys? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's who I like. I Which one's got Jay Jay Timbo? He's in sync. Okay, but I'm like just sync. like everybody. Which one's got Joey? Yeah, in Joey. Sync. Oh yeah. Uh, he made them hot dogs. Yeah. 
get close already. Yeah, he had to go to a food truck. He he has a food truck now. Everybody, rock your body right. I want it that way. Tell me <laughs> why. Ain't nothing but a heartache. Tell me why. Ain't nothing but a mistake to like Backstreet Boys. You really want to like NSYNC. Because they are better than Backstreet Boys. Uh, what food places will be in Toy Story Land? I hope it's good stuff. Uh, all that I know of is a Woody's Lunchbox. It's all quick service. There's no like sit-down restaurants or anything like that. And uh, I think that's it. There's like a a place that that has um, uh, cheese, like that Baybell cheese. If you want like Toy Story themed uh, food, you're better off going to DCA because they've got more options for Toy Story Land stuff or Toy Story food. Oh right. Sorry, I was reading. <clears throat> we got a letter from Robert who wrote us a letter last oh, week. Oh yeah. And he, well, you should read this. He, I read it, yeah. Yeah, he was explaining he his, explained. I figured it's more for us, because yeah. it was just questions that you were asking. It was awesome. Um, I, I read it. Yeah. It but was it was really interesting. Very interesting. So thank you for writing a letter to explain more about it. Um, and we're glad that you're doing okay. So, and we hope you have an awesome time in May as well. Um, so. Uh, you won points for Backstreet being number one. Yeah. What the heck? <laughs> okay, really quick. So this next one is from Chris. Um, he just wanted to thank us for our positive videos and knowing that there are good folks like yourselves out there gives me hope for humanity. Um, thank you. We really appreciate that. And I miss your stash, Tim, but I get it. I have a love hate relationship with my facial hair. Rarely does it last for more than a few months before it goes away. Um, he appreciates the effort that you were taking to get it to be so magnificent. Thank you. And when it stops being fun, it's not worth continuing. Yeah. When you can't eat ice cream, you got to shave your mustache. That's what I said. I didn't actually start my beard at the same time as you, but it lasted a month and a half, so you win. Oh, no. <laughs> um, Jen, your smile is amazing and always triggers one in me. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you for your um, eager positivity. Please accept the small token of my appreciation on doing what you do well and love to band it. I love it. Thank you, Chris. They're going to hang out right here with us. For so this cool. Live mail blog. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you so much. That's really cool. Really cool. Shout out to Caroline. Shout out. Bye, Caroline Cole. Goff. Do you happen to have a relative named Harper? No. No, not you. Caroline. Oh. Why? Harper Golf. Who's that? instrumental that is it. Who is he? A boy or a girl? It's a boy. Oh, okay, because I said he, and then I was like, wait, maybe it's a girl. Well, Caroline's a girl. No, Harper Goff. Yeah, that's a guy. <laughs> okay. Definitely a guy. Shout out to Monica. Because it's a good day to have a good day. Yeah. Today is a good day to have a good day. Uh, live show. This is from Dee Dee and Patrick. Oh my gosh, we met Dee Dee. I know who this, I didn't even look at this yet, but I know who Dee Dee is. We met her. I, we were in line for Soren, and this was recently, right? When we were at yeah. the, it was when we was were the there for day. our media day, which was such an exciting day, and I'll never forget her because she came up to us and she's like, I'm Dee Dee, D E D E. You'll never forget it. That's how you spell it, and I won't ever forget it. You're right. Um, but I literally, I was fine all day. We met Dee Dee and I just immediately started like choking, dying. I was just like, oh, <laughs> oh you were coughing and everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I felt so bad because she's like, I'm so happy to meet you. And I was literally like, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. So Dee Dee, I'm so sorry. I coughed on you. I felt terrible about it for the rest of the day. Um, but it was so nice to meet you. Yeah. There uh, she is. She was so cute. Very nice. It was great to finally meet you both in person after watching your videos every day for two years. Uh, my first trip to Walt Disney World was in 1971, and my husband's was in 1976. Even though we have been going to WDW since the 70s, we need your help planning our trips. Thank you for the bids. Also, we were celebrating our ninth wedding anniversary Aww. on the 28th of March. Meeting you both on our anniversary vacation was a big highlight of our trip 
Love you both and Bandit, too. Aww. Well, thank you. And here's Yeah, it was so nice to meet you guys. On their wedding day. Let me see. Oh, my gosh. And then here's a picture of Jen. Holy cow. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's how we know that that was the day. Right? That's so funny. It was so nice to meet you. That was awesome. Thank you so much. That was awesome. Oh, shout out and congratulations to Susan from our raft of wandering otters on being cancer free. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Finally get to watch you guys live because I'm homesick. Heart company. Aw. Well, congratulations, Susan. Sorry, I was burping. Congratulations, oh, no. Susan. Uh, shout out to Keith, but not to stop using our outro. What? He keeps saying it now it's time to pay the price, and he should keep saying it. Why? So keep, keep, because his his son I think wants him to stop saying it. Oh. <laughs> and I would like for him to continue. We did buy the robot um, vacuum, and we showed it I think in the video today. Yeah, it was in it was in today's video. Yeah, we bought a Nito. It's Nito. It was um, how long have we had it? Not long. For like two weeks. And it's really picking up a lot of dirt. Yeah. Like so much. <laughs> yes. Too much. Um, someone asked if I will ever go back to blonde. And I don't know, maybe one day. But it's just that blonde is so hard. My shade of blonde was like a very natural, like ashy blonde. So it wasn't like a pretty blonde. So to keep up with like the pretty blonde, it was it was very damaging to my hair. Yeah. Um, And then somebody else asked if I was going to um, post on my channel again. And I am going to post on my channel again, but I need to find time to do it. <laughs> but I, I really want to. I have I have all these ideas written down. I have a whole list of things that I'm like, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. And I just haven't had time. So one day. Ooh, favorite yeah. HHN house of all time. Of all time? Yeah. What was mine? What's it called? Gothic? No. The one with the house. The oh, yeah. House. Dead end. Dead end. Dead end. Yeah, that was yeah. a good one. That was a good one. Uh, love you. Uh, Ian says, love the videos. You guys are awesome. Would you recommend the foot golf? Yeah. Yeah. I it had was, a lot of fun. It was fun. But I will say, um, thank you, by the way. We really appreciate that. Um, but I will say with the foot golf, the golfers, like, you could tell that we were making them mad. Yeah. So the golfers don't like the foot golfers. Um, I wish there was a time that it was like, we only do foot golf during this time. Yeah, because I think that would be... I did feel like I was going to get hit in the head with the golf ball. Yeah, and I felt rushed because I thought, like, oh, no, we got to keep an eye out for the golfers that are going to be behind us. And I kept looking back and looking back. And yeah. the, the courses go, like, opposite. Like, the golfers are behind you for the first three, mm -hmm. and then they go this way. But at, at a certain point, way. they're hitting them at you. Yeah. So that's scary. Yeah. Yeah. Don't Very use exciting. your toes. Yeah. Definitely don't use your toes like we did because it my foot really hurts. <laughs> um we plan on moving to our uh, Michael says we plan on moving to Orlando in about a year and a half and we watch your videos oh, every day yeah. to keep the dream alive and real. Hope to meet you all one day. That's awesome. Thank you. And congrats. Yeah, we hope that you guys um have a an easy move. And Kelsey wants to say hi wants us to say hi to Joni. They'll be at Disney Joni? May the 5th. Oh, hi, Joni. Yeah, Millennial Pink Ears, thoughts? Um, I haven't actually seen them. They're right there. Well, okay, so here's the thing. Um, we're not going to do a giveaway of these ears today. We have them for a giveaway. But we have three things that we still need to mail out for giveaway winners. Mm -hmm. um, I forget who exactly. It's for Wendy... And Katie. We have it all written down. There's and somebody right else. There. Yeah. So um, those things have not been mailed out yet. And we are super, super, super sorry. We were supposed to do it today. And we didn't. Well, we ran out of time. Yeah. So um, Mercury. We, oh, I know. I feel so bad. So we're going to get them done on Tuesday. We're going to mail them out. Yeah. So if you are a contest winner and you haven't received your items yet, Tuesday they're going to be mailed out. We're really sorry for the delay. So we don't want to do a giveaway when we have three things to mail out. But... Yeah, I was um, gonna say, do you want to just show them? I do want to show them. Wait, where are they? Uh, oh, they're on my side. Oh, I was like, what? Okay. So we'll show them to you guys, so you guys can see them. So if you want to get them on your own, um, but we will be giving these away as well. Just not right this second. How do you make it and see it? I think it's here. That's it's, what they look like. Yeah. 
starts to break. But they're cute. I like them. Should I try them on? This yeah. Is, where's the pair that you cut the thing off? That's them. Oh, well, I cut this part off. Oh, okay. So I never cut that off. Let's see. Oh, no. I just don't want to, like... Well, they look nice. I like them. I like these, like, fluffy bows that they've been doing. And I think... The thing about the fluffy bow that I don't like is I think they stole this idea, like, from Etsy shops. Oh, no. Or not, I shouldn't say that. They didn't steal this idea. But, like, they weren't doing these poofy bows until the Etsy shops were doing them. So that's kind of a bummer. But they do look nicer. <laughs> so, I don't know. I like them. I like them a lot. You know what I, I like? I like them better than the rose gold. Do you? Yeah. The ro these are more comfortable than the rose gold. But I think the rose gold, it's cuter. Yeah. Personally. Uh, sorry, I'm basic. But... It's two different kinds of sequins. Can you tell? I don't know if you can see that. Oh, yeah, you can. And I think that's kind of weird looking. That's got it. But I also like it at the same time. Because it looks kind of squiggly, doesn't it? Yeah. Is that how the rose gold ones are? No. They're the same. Are they? Yeah. Let me see. They is have... it a different bow? Is it not the puffy bow? No, it is a puffy bow. You can see it from right here. They're the same sequins. Oh, I, I couldn't see it. I just didn't want you to pull it out. Oh, it's got like a totally different bow. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. I thought you meant this. Like, these are the same sequins. Yeah. As on the side of the millennial pink ones. Huh. Yeah. Pretty strange. So, yeah. So, we'll be giving these away. Um, we're just going to have to wait until we mail out. We'll do, how about we'll do them on the next mail blog? Yeah. We'll give them away next. On Tuesday. On Tuesday. Does this mean so. the rose gold ones are now being discontinued? No, they're still selling them both. So yeah, there's a, a ton yeah. of the rose gold ones still. Ah, okay. Um, okay, wait. So this next one is from Katie. Katie is uh, from Missouri, and they went to Disney World four times, her and her family. They are using the videos to help plan their trip to Universal Studios, which is cool. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Are you okay? Do you need some water? I ran out of my tea. Oh, no, there's a little bit of water left. Thank you. Sorry. Um, they watch our videos before dinner, which I love. I love that. Thank you. Um, they love when we show the ducks and the bunnies that are hanging around the park. My dad likes when you show your Simpsons clock at the end. And everyone in my family enjoys your videos at Volcano Bay. My mom especially likes it when you show the fireworks. I hope to see you at Universal in May of 2019. Oh. Now it's time to pay the price from Katie and the Sherman family. Well, well thank, thank you. you. We really appreciate that. We hope you guys have an awesome time. Um, and we hope that you get to do all the fun stuff at Universal. This one is from Christina. It says, my family and I enjoy watching your videos. Great camera slash editing skills. Thank you. Our six-year-old son just might be your biggest fan. Aw. We are DVC members and flying down a few times this year. If you would like entry into any DVC area or event, uh, we'd be happy to do that as your guest. Well, thank you. Thank you for the yeah. offer. Um, yeah. We thank really you. appreciate that. It's a nice offer. Thank you. Yeah. So thank you to Christina. Good night, gaming reality. How do you guys do giveaways? Do you enter? Um, okay. So the way that we do the giveaways is we just do them here in the live show. But there's not going to be one tonight. So next next week when we have the live show, we will have a giveaway. Yeah. And so you just ha we usually just say like say this word, and then we pick somebody at random in the comments. So that's yeah. how we do it, just to make it easier on everybody. But Carlo Carlos says, "Hey guys, my girlfriend and I are local Floridians from Miami, and we love your Disney videos. We'll be there for Cinco de Mayo. Hope to see you. Well, thank you." Yeah. Oh my gosh, uh, I don't know why I'm like talking now. Oh no. Chronicles of Charge says, Can you guys see yourselves vlogging in the theme parks when you're 80 years of age? 80? 80. I don't know. I, I don't know about 80. That it, technology is going to change. Yeah, I feel like by then it'll just be all theme parks. They'll be like um, virtual. Right? Yeah, it'll just be in your, in your mind. Yeah. So you won't need anybody to vlog it for you. Right. Can you give me that? Um, yeah, because I'm going to. I figured what we can do, because we're not going to be able to open all of these right now. Um, do you want to open some of the boxes yeah. as well? Yeah. Um, 
Brittany says, how does the giveaway work? What do I need to do? I think we already answered that one, didn't we? Yeah, but we just, um, next week, we're going to, uh, we'll just have you say something, like, we'll say, say you want the ears, and then you just leave a comment in this chat that you're in right now, and then um, we pick somebody at random. Yeah. But you have to be here in the live show. That's the only thing. Natalie, or Nate, says, hi, guys. The Nichols fam Loves watching your videos. Watched you play foot golf last night as a family. Thank Can you. Can you say hi to Major, Kinley, and Indy? Hello. Hi, Major, Kinley, and Indy. Uh, and Dan in Dan Inviter says, hey, guys, I only found your vids just a couple of months ago, and I love them. I'm to WDW in June like last week, and I hope to see you there if you... See a guy with the pink and blue hair walking around. That's me. Well, we'll keep an eye out for you. And thank you so much. Uh, Tom says, we love you guys. Thank you for years of entertainment. Well, thank you so much. Foot golf. I've never heard of it. Did you get to watch the video from when we did foot golf, JJ? Tim, any experience with drones? No, because most of Central Florida is a no-fly zone. So, uh, no. <laughs> I right, have not. Wanna... Yeah, what do you want me to do? Um, which, which ones do you still need to read? Just these two right here. Okay, so do you want to give me that other one? Okay, cool. This one is from, does it say Shelly? Yes. From Shelly. Hello there from your Canadian fans. Thank you so much for the incredible content and hard work you and Jen put into the vlog. Thank you. Uh, a few years ago, I took my niece on the airboat rides at Midway near Christmas in Titusville. Had a top-notch experience on the St. John's River. Have you ever been that way lately? Uh, would it be something that you would want to try and share with your viewers? Your vlogs are the most fun, practically and consistently reliable. Where? Reliable YouTube efforts. Practical and consistently reliable YouTube efforts. Okay. Yeah, thanks. That's very nice. Thank you. Love the Falcon Heavy launch video. Absolutely top quality. Well, thank you so much. That actually was, um, Tim was working really hard to get that as a still shot, like as still as a, of a shot as he could. Because he was so zoomed in on the actual launch itself. Mm -hmm. It was literally like. Yeah, I was like this. <laughs> so um, so we appreciate we appreciate you guys uh, saying nice things. Thank you. We really appreciate that. Yes. Wait. You are reliable bloggers. Well, it's thank you. snowing in Nebraska? Really? Holy macaroni. Wow. Why? That seems kind of nuts, huh? Holy cow. Here, I think you're going to really like this. Oh. Yeah, this is awesome. Hey, Tim and Jen, we found these old maps and flyers, and we thought you might like them from Sophia and Steve. Oh. Sophia? Sophia? Is that what it said? Yeah. What did I say? You said, I don't Sophia. know. Sophia. You, you, you emphasize the wrong syllable. <laughs> oh, so this is from Potter's Wax Museum, which is haunted, and I went there. And I can't wait to go back. Wait, Potter's Wax Museum is? Yeah. Whoa. Is St. Augustine? This is pretty neat. Ooh, the old jail. I went to the old jail, and it's supposedly haunted, too. Oh. This so is neat. creepy. Oh. Planet Ocean. The stream cut out on your, your drone answer. Oh. the I can't do drones because they are... Uh, there's like most of Central Florida is a no-fly zone. Yeah, so we could get one and we'd never be able to use it, or we would be fined for using it. So we'd have to find a place far away that we'd be able to use it. This is Lego Land now. Cypress Gardens is. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see that. Holy cow! Where did mm. you find all of these like retro? I'd like to know. That's intense. What what year some of this stuff is from? What is this? Nineteen seventy. Look at this. Wait, wait. Human kite flyer. Oh, that looks cool. Right? That's so interesting. Ripley's Museum uh, in St. Augustine. Oh, the Miami Sea Aquarium. Oh. Oh, my goodness. This one is yeah, amazing. Yeah, this is the one that I was like, you're going to be like loving this. 
This is uh, St. John F. Kennedy Space Center, NASA tours. Wow. This is so cool. I almost feel like you shouldn't be opening it like that because you're bending it. Look at that. This is awesome. Can you remember Circus World? No. Yes. Where is that? Circus World was closer to Tampa. Oh, okay. Um, And that's, oh, Lion Country Safari. Yeah. Heck yeah. I like how just everybody's driving a pacer. This is or so a Datsun. Nice. I can't believe <laughs> this. Is this real? It's like, did you really do this? You really, you really just drove yeah. a little sports car around all of these lions? What? Why is the only car that they're showing this Datsun? Maybe they have a sponsorship with Datsun. I don't know. This is really insane. Like, oh my god! The chimpanzee's wearing a tiny sweater. <laughs> Look at this, you guys. Can you see? Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm glad you got to catch us live. We love that. This is amazing. Um, well, thank you guys so much. Yeah, this is really cool. These are really neat. Thank you. I always feel bad, though, when people send us their, like, retro stuff because I just feel like, don't you want it? It makes me feel bad. Like, I'm glad that we have it. I really appreciate it. But I also feel like, don't you want it? Right. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, Mixed Man <clears throat> says, arriving tomorrow in Orlando from Toronto. Have I you ever been to have... Canada? No. Oh, we didn't? Uh, no, we did that one. Oh, okay. Hope to see you guys at Disney World. Jen's been to Canada. Yeah. I've never been to Canada. But I've only literally been to Niagara Falls. Like, I was just on the other side of the border, just, like, two steps over. So I didn't really go to Canada, I feel like. Ashley says, hi, my hubby Clint and I are annual pass holders from West Virginia oh. and love your videos. Your Animal Kingdom Lodge tour convinced us to stay there last time, and Yay. it was our favorite resort yet. So thank you. That's awesome. We've never stayed there. We want to stay there. Also, Jen loves seeing all your ears. Oh, thank you. I'm going to, I know these, this one is my favorite. <laughs> I'm going to do a um, ear tour video for you guys really, I don't want to say really soon, in the month of April. So there hey, you go. <laughs> can you grab that one? This one? The other one. No. This one? Under. This one? No. Yeah. This pink one? Yeah. Okay. Because somebody just asked about it. Oh, okay. Can I do this one really quick? Because yeah. I have it on my... Um, okay, so this one is from Amy, Martin, Luke, and Michael. And they're from the Netherlands. They started watching in 2015, and now they can't wait to sit down after dinner and watch our videos. Thank you guys for watching. After, like, I really do like that it's become like a family thing where like the whole family can watch after dinner or whatever. I think that's really cool. Um, so they went to the Orlando theme parks four times, and the last time that they came was in 2015. And they bought a new house in 2017, so that they're doing like renovations and stuff, or like um, you know, like upgrading it and stuff for this year. And then after that, they hope to be able to come back to Orlando. But they use our videos to kind of like reminisce on their trip, which is really cool. And so they want to visit Disneyland Paris, and their son Luke enjoys our videos. He's six, and he made this drawing. Oh. Which is, and they even laminated it, which is so cute. <laughs> This is awesome. I love it. It's so good. Um, so that's Mickey in front of the castle. And he even signed it with his signature. Yeah, so he did great. We have an original Luke, you guys. I like I'm, I'm a lot. pretty darn excited. So thank you for sharing your adventures and keep up the good work. And then they also sent this, which is really cute. Um, it's a, it says to love every day. It's just mm. like a little cute, like you hang it up. I thought it was like a clipboard. Well, it is, but it's like an art holder. Oh, but it's also made so you could like put pins in it too. Yeah, but it's just like this. Huh. Yeah, it's very cute. I like this a lot. Thank you. So that again was from Amy, Martin, Luke, and Michael. Well, wow. so thank you. Oh, it says something on the back of this. Oh, does it? Yeah. Of this? Yeah. Oh. Oh, it says, oh, it says love every day watching the tracker videos from Amy, Martin, Luke, that's their last name. Oh, gotcha. From the Netherlands. Yeah. Well, thank you. Yeah, we really appreciate it. Any idea what's replacing Bill and Ted at HHM? Um, why does why does everybody think that it's being replaced? Did they say something? No. Because a bunch of people have um, people tweeted me that people were asking in the live show, so I'm confused. Why? Like, did did somebody say something and we missed it? No, I think that they're just thinking like, why wouldn't they have two shows? Well, I thought that somebody said there were going to be two shows. 
It's a good question. I'll have to look at the blog again. Do you guys did, know? Like, did Patrick say something? Who's Patrick? He's the guy that wrote the blog. Patrick Braylord. Oh, I thought, <laughs> I thought you meant our friend Patrick. Oh, no. And I was like, does he know? <laughs> Shout out to Trent, mm -hmm. Autumn, Melissa, and Tony. Shout out to you guys. Oh, thanks. <laughs> uh, who was La Plus coolest of them all? Ooh. With Beku? No, Buku. Bo oh, we'll read this. I can't. Well, I don't. That's the only word I know. Oh, Buku de Talents, too. Who's sweetest of all, Mademoiselles? Ooh. We, oui, we, oui, Sherry. It's you and Tim. Yeah. And I even. This is cool. Wait, does it come yeah, with Yeah, it's this? like a pen. Oh, it comes with like a little Marie pen. It has a little, a little fluff. Bandit, you're killing me. Did he shake the camera again? <laughs> yes. Sorry. This is really cute. So just this part. Oh, and you put the pen in the... Oh, there's like there's a cap down yeah, there, Yeah, there's too. like a little holder and everything. Wow. How fun. Not this part. Oh, this gotcha. Part. Okay, so this is from Sarah. So she was buying birthday cards and saw this card, and it was a sign. I agree. I love this. Thank you for sharing your lives with us. I've been following you for a bit over a year, and I... Thank you for never deleting the original vlogs. You are oh. first, the first YouTube creators I followed, which beyond late to the YouTube life, I started with the 2012 vlog playlist accidentally. You pulled me in with Disney. A QA and a showed that I was starting in the middle, and it's been a crazy experiment experience uh, to time travel through your lives. Oh, dear. Um, this gift card is to encourage home vlogs. I love movie TV reviews you used to do. Oh, this gift card. Sorry, she sent us a Netflix gift card. Oh, my gosh. That's so – thank you. That's really nice. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, that's really cool. Um, thank you for the positive vibes from Sarah. And then she also did something for, like, for us to read off camera, so we'll read that off camera. Um, but thank you. Yeah, we really appreciate that, and thank you for coming along. Sorry you watched the old videos because they're not great. <laughs> oh, no. But thank you. Uh, vlog number 72 is missing. What happened? Mail vlog number 72. Is it? Why? I don't know. That's recent. There's somebody, one on my phone that, like, something... Well, somebody left a comment. Maybe it might be the same person that left a comment that said that their thing that they sent was in that mail vlog, and they were trying to show somebody else, like, their part of the mail vlog, and they couldn't find it. And I know for a little bit of time, YouTube was, like, updating, and so everything changed. And maybe yeah. it was that one that everything changed. Yeah. Because there were there were some people. I want to say it was maybe Adam. Because Adam live or does live shows like live streams sometimes. And I think his were going away. Oh well, he deletes his sometimes. Oh okay, so maybe that's what it was. Maybe I just don't know what's going on. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm I'll sorry. I'll look into it because I mean it's not like we have it. Oh wait, private can you read your anything? card from New Jersey? Which card is it? Card from New Jersey. Hard from New Jersey. Uh, Supernova says, hi from Jimmy, Loretta, Chloe, and Hazel. Watching in Ireland. We'll be out there in June and would love to bump into you guys. Yeah, if you guys see us, please say hello. Hard from New Jersey. I read one from New Jersey earlier. Did you? Because these are not... I don't yeah. have anything. We might have already read it. We may have already read it. What was your, What was her name? I don't know. Oh shoot! It already went asking, by. Dang it! I'm sorry. Um, I don't see a card from New Jersey. Hey Tim, we cooked the churros. They didn't turn out great. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry. What happened? Uh, we honestly, I think it was like a fluke. Like I don't even know how we did it. I sometimes I'm pretty good at baking, like at like pastries. Somebody told us that that same. Uh, oh my gosh! Yeah, the purple Martin. We got something from the Purple Martin Conservatory. Yeah. So did you guys remember when we saw the Purple Martin things at Disney? And it was really cool. He sent us a message saying that he was going to send us this. Who? Was it the guy that... No, no. He's just here another guy that likes Purple Martins? Yeah, he runs the red... The, or he's part of this... Oh, sorry. I was giving you the knife. Oh, I'm sorry. How cool. Because the Purple Martin thing was actually really one of the coolest parts of our of our day. Can we buy the things? Maybe we should put Purple Martin things out in our yard so we can have yeah. them. Oh it my says gosh. You can host. Heck yeah. Should we do it? I'm going to put up a Purple Martin house. They're really cool. Um, so this is from um, the Purple Martin Conservation Association. Oh my gosh. 
It's okay. So this is from Mercedes, and she says that her husband. Oh, I'm sorry. She. I'm sorry. Oh no, no worries. Um, I was just reading this part here, but she found our videos to be helpful when they traveled. So they've watched our videos. Um, they inspired them to start their own vlog. So they watched our behind the seats tour video. Um, they were excited to see that we were interested in Purple Martins. And she is a field biologist for the Purple Martin Conservation Association. They're an international nonprofit organization dedicated to the conservation of Purple Martins through research, wildlife management techniques, and education. Um, oh, so there's two Purple Martin update, like their magazine, their newsletter. Um, that's where we can read about their work with the Disney Conservation Fund. Um, oh, and their expedition to Brazil. That's so cool. Be sure to tune into their YouTube channel, Purple Martin Conservation, to watch their nest cam live, where you can view the inside of a gourd and watch a purple martin pair raise their young for the entire season. That's pretty neat. That's really cool. Oh my gosh, how neat. And then, yeah, she said to email her if we want to start our own colony. This is so cool, you guys. Oh, I'm sorry. Everybody's like, say Purple Martin again. Purple Martin. <laughs> Um, so this is awesome. Thank you so much to Mercedes and also to the entire Purple Martin Conservation Association for the work that you guys do. Um, and also for sending over the information for us. We question, really appreciate it. Question for you, Mercedes, if you're in here. Is there a picture of you inside of this book, like doing, like, is this you? Doing Purple Martin stuff? Doing Purple Martin stuff. Pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Yeah, I really like that a lot, actually. Like, we have bats around the house. Yeah, I don't know um, if you guys are new to the videos. You may not have seen it, but we did. We had bats in our attic. Yeah. And then we built a bat house so, to house them. The card is from Richard. Oh. The New Jersey card? I think we read it. Did we not read that already? I don't know. Or is it? maybe it hasn't come yet. Uh, Ashley says... I'm local to Orlando. Met Tim opening night of Happily Ever After. That made a, that made it perfect. Jen, you are honestly a role model. You both make my day better. I go to Disney Weekly. My goal is to meet Jen. Oh my gosh! Thank you for the nice words, Ashley. That's so sweet. Aww, oh, no. sorry. That was me. Sorry. It's because Bandit's like leaning up against it, so one side of the tripod's like oh, sorry. up in the air. Oh well, thank you so much, though. We really appreciate that. Um, and we go to the parks very often, so I am sure that we will definitely see you there at some point, for sure. Um, but thank you. So this is from Chelsea. Chelsea says that I can't thank you enough, which I love this card. It's, like, so simple but really pretty. Mm. Um, I can't thank you enough for all that you do for this community. I hope you know how much we appreciate it. Thank you for being so honest about different struggles um, y'all face. You don't know the full impact of telling your story and sharing. You the best. I hope you enjoy this shirt. I had to. Oh. I didn't open it yet. Let's see. What, what is it? Let's see here. Oh. What is it? I love it when people quote me. Oh. <laughs> That's brilliant. That's so funny. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is amazing. It's a Spreadshirt shirt. That's so funny. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what size is it? It's your size, actually. Oh, so I can wear that? <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, my God. Thank you, Chelsea. That's very fun, and I will definitely be wearing it. I love that. <laughs> Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. That's awesome. You want to do this one? This yeah. feels like a book. Let's my brother see. and I used to love the beginning of your videos. You would say, oh, um, like, happy day. You Oh, stop you're really wiggling us around. That wasn't me. That was you um, because the bandit is leaning up against it. So now the computer <laughs> is leaning up against it. Oh, no. Um, so they really miss us saying happy whatever day of the week it was. And the reason why we don't do that anymore is because this, I hate it when cardboard scraps, scrapes against other cardboard. Um, it's because sometimes our videos don't go up that next day anymore. Um, so it wouldn't make, we don't want to confuse people. So I don't know. I don't know if we should do that because I don't want to confuse everybody. I'm sorry. I don't know who this is from. It's a drop ship from Amazon. It should say here. It doesn't. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, Sometimes no. they they can put it on <gasps> this? this. It's the complete haunted mansion comic or Whoa. graphic novel collection. Oh, that's neat. It's from Disney Kingdoms and Marvel. 
Yeah. I didn't know that this was a thing. I'm going to open it. Are you? Yeah. That's so we can look at it. Thoughts on Star Wars Land. Um, super excited for it. Super duper excited for it. Thank you, Tim and Jen. You both make me want to make my own vlogs. I will continue watching your adventures, plus maybe make my own YouTube channel. Thank you, Carl. Yeah, you definitely, if it's something that you think that you would enjoy or something that you want to do, it's definitely a fun thing. This looks awesome. Let me see. Oh, man. Ooh. Wait, let me see the first page. Is this the whole story or are there more of them? I think this is it. Does it say like how the Haunted Mansion started? I don't know. But I want to know the origin story. Don't we know that? Do we? Yeah, Master Gacy and all, Gracie and all that stuff. Do we know? I don't think we do. Yeah. What is this? This is the origin story. <gasps> In New Orleans. Oh my gosh. Ooh, this is exciting, you guys. Yeah. Ooh, it looks so cool. Which mansion is it? The one in um. Oh, North, this is yeah. This is Disneyland. This is Disneyland's mansion. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exciting. Um, yes, Bandit is asleep. Oh, yeah, like there's Leo down here. Thing. Did you uh, did you read every card from New Jersey? The first one you read was from my friend. Oh, that was the one that um you said. I think somebody else wrote a second one. Yeah. And it was from Robert, right? Is that what it, that's? Is it this one? This is amazing. Oh, look, there's the Hitchhiking Ghosts and everything. Is it this one? I don't... Because this didn't have a... That's New from... Jersey. Yeah, it's this one, I think. Right? Is this the card? Sorry, I'm trying to, like, get the lighting so you can see it. Is that it? I think this might be it. Because I don't think we read this one yet, right? I don't think so. Yes, okay, all right, yes. So um let's see it says a special note of thanks and this one's from jackie and it says hi tim jen and bandit i sorry i couldn't find a postcard and i'm writing very small <laughs> it's okay um you guys are so great together right before bed or sometimes during class depending when you're when you put up the vlog um i watch one video be sad it's over and just go back and watch old videos from oh, 20, no. from like past years I love the latest one where you made plant puns. Wait, is that what it says? Plant puns? I think so. Yeah, okay. Overall, my favorite videos are the hotel tours, the Epcot videos, especially Garden Grill, my favorite restaurant. That was actually my first time eating there, and it was really fun. Yeah. I And the Jimmy Fallon ride, grand opening. I love Jimmy. I went to see his show and rehearsals. How many times? 13 times so far. Oh, wow. wow. That's really cool. Soon to be my, soon to be four, 14th next month. Anyway, your videos are funny and creative and I have a mix, oh, a mix of depression and anxiety. So watching your old and new videos help to reduce the levels of both. We're really happy that we can um, help you with that. So thank you for like making us a part of your day. Um, we definitely appreciate it. I hope to see more of Bandit too. I will be back in Disney in 2020. I hope to meet you guys. I went in September of 2017 and January of 2018. I missed you um, a day later at every park. Oh, oh no. no, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, so what's your favorite quick service restaurant? Um, Thank you so much by, for sending the card, by the way. We really appreciate it. Quick service. Quick service. I would say, well, I know the one that you had recently you really liked. I know it wasn't in the park, though. Oh, yeah, Spyglass? That yeah. was really good. That was at Caribbean Beach Resort. But, like, in the park quick service would maybe be the Waffle Place behind the castle. Oh, yeah. That was good. The um, Sleepy Hollow Place. Yeah, that is good. We'll go with that. I'm trying to think of what else there is, though. I can't even really think of anything. I don't know. We don't usually do... Excuse me. Sorry. We don't usually do quick service. Yeah. Jacob says, go to Hollywood Studios in 2019. Can't wait for Star Wars. Love the videos. Also, guys, thank you. Thank you. And, yeah, we uh, really appreciate it. I wanted to say thank you to Tim. Thank you. To you, Tim? No, to Tim. Oh. Camosa. Can I see that? Yeah. Why do you say now it's time to pay the price at the end of the videos? So we actually have a video. If you search the Tim Tracker, now it's time to pay the price, that video will pop up. 
and we give a full detailed answer. It's like a Q and A video. Yes. How many Cantine for quick service. Oh yeah, Satuli Canteen. Yeah. Was that quick service though? Yeah. Okay, then yeah, that's because I was thinking of that, but I thought maybe it's not quick service. Sorry, banned that again. He just like moved. Oh. All right. Somebody says you have our box now. Oh, we do. Yeah. Let's see here. Okay. Here's the Shakeology box. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. Sorry, I was trying to. Let me do. I didn't want to wake up this. Hold on. Sorry. It's going to be kind of rumbly for a bit. Okay. Ooh. I think we're solid now. And oh no, the the table's floating. Okay. Oh Good no. <laughs> um. Real all right. Quick. We are so. Oh. Dream Disney says, can you film in 364K VR on rides this summer, 4th of July weekend time, doing 12 WDW tours in 12 days? Wow. Uh, I, have a, I have I, a 360 camera. Can I film you oh. in 360? Can you film me? Uh, I, don't, that, <laughs> I don't understand. I'm confused. We... Um, I don't know where we're going to be for 4th of July weekend. So if you're asking if you can film us, we don't know where we're going to be. So probably not. But if you can film with yes. a 360 cam, you totally can. Yeah. 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 Sorry, I didn't understand. So it says, um, this is from um, Probably. the Rogers family. Uh, we're so excited to send you this package. We hope that Jen loves her Marie ears. Oh. These are fun. Oh, yeah. Those are really fun. Let's see. I like the little pearls on the outside. Very cute. Those are nice. I love the little bow, too. It's, like, so shiny. Ooh. They feel very sturdy, too, which is always nice. Um, so she says that my daughter loves you guys. We watch you every night, and you're getting us extra pumped for our May trip. I even asked my daughter. I think this says Anna? Aria? Uh oh, I can't read it. I'm sorry. I think it says Aria. Is it Aria? Who she's most excited to meet. And she says, Tim and Jen. We hope to spot you guys. She drew Tim some pictures, too. Sorry. Hold on. I thought maybe because they're they're in here. So I want to see oh. if maybe they were going to say what the name was. Thanks so much for your blogs. It Keep is. Up the it's door. Aria. Okay. Aria. Cool. Awesome. Well, I saw the little, the little Mickey... Um, dot above it, so I'm like, I think that's mine. And there's a butterfly. I love it. And then she also colored Murray for you. Blue. And then there's Darkwing Duck. Very cool. Are you okay? He wants to get up and stretch. Aww. And then also, if you're interested in checking out her ears, you can see her on Facebook. I've got ears on Facebook. Um, and then on Instagram, Disney Mama A N G, I believe. Disney Mama A N G on Insta. So thank you guys so much. Oh, right here. You you wrote it over here and I totally was not looking at that. So my bad. Um it's from Jeff, Gretchen, Aria, and Gunner. Yeah. Thank you. I love these. I really appreciate it. Are you what, okay, man? What are you doing, buddy? What time is it? Seven thirty. And when time do we start? Six. Well, five forty five. Yeah. Or oh. is he gonna... oh, there he goes. Okay, okay. I just didn't know if he was like gonna move around or anything. <clears throat> uh, somebody wants to know if you have maleficent ears. I do not. No, I don't. I don't think I have any villain ears. Yeah. Do I? I don't think I do. I don't think you do. Yeah. I like yeah. how both of us are just like Sorry. <laughs> looking over <laughs> at the right ears. <laughs> um. Okay. Uh, sorry, that was Fawn that wanted to know that. Oh, sorry. It's 423 in Los Angeles. Oh. Whoa. Did you see this? Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. Look at this. How cool is that? That's from Devin. Greetings once again from Wisconsin's with from Wisconsin. Wisconsin's. Sorry, it was from Liz and Devin, and then I said Wisconsin's. Greetings once again from Wisconsin. Best best wishes. <laughs> best wishes. Uh, Tomorrowland. I love it. I wish they still had these walk around characters. Me too. They're amazing. 
do you have any Tim Tracker ears? I actually do. Um, a couple of people made me specific like mustache ears. Um, they, they don't say Tim Tracker on them specifically, but they're mustache ears. Yeah. I don't know. I see some right there. Yeah. I, I, I think, got like kissies on them for you. And I think I have probably five pairs of ears that are meant to be like um, Tim Tracker. Yeah. Yeah, there's some right there too. Yeah, I oh, do. Yeah. yeah. So this next little letter is from, were you done? Sorry. Yeah. Okay. It was from Allie and she sent over, she drew on her little thing here too, which was very cute. And um, it's so, I love this. I really like that. So Allie says, do you remember me? I'm the girl whose name is Allie. We are going to Disney and my sister likes you and may be hoping to see you. Very I'm, cool. But I'm definitely hoping to see you. Oh, and my sister is sending you one too. She sent you the same front as my card. And my dad thinks he saw you, but we didn't know. Oh. I just talked to my mom and she said to tell you to grow back your mustache. Oh no. <laughs> from Allie. I'm sorry, and, Allie's mom. And then she drew a the castle, which actually looks really awesome. You did a really good job, Allie. Yeah. So now that I know that your sister also sent one. Yeah, right there. We're gonna read your sisters as well. Just let me open on that. Okay, so same one. And this is from Ellie's oh, sister. Did she say what her sister's name was? Did I miss it? Her name is Isabella. Oh, sorry. I put my foot up. Oh, okay. So Isabella drew us some cool stuff in the card. She, I think this is, oh, sorry. Where are we? I think that's me. Oh. I think that's you. Oh, cool. And then this is the letter that she wrote us. I love it. Well, thank you so much. We really appreciate you both taking time to send us some awesome letters. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Uh, Mark says, love you guys. Love the vlog, guys. Watch every day over in the UK. I'm traveling over with my son in October. Would you recommend using Uber from the airport for a standard transfer? Love the content. From the airport to the like to Disney? Yeah. Uh, I would... I don't know, actually. That's a hard one. So, I think, I think Uber does like normal Ubers there. They used to only do Uber Black. Mm -hmm. So I think you can get a normal <clears throat> Uber, and I think it'll cost you around sixty dollars to get to Disney. I sixty dollars from the airport? Yeah. Wow, that's a lot. Yeah. I didn't think it was that much. Yeah. So if. Uh, I don't know if you can find a transfer that's cheaper than that. Oh, use oh. Magical Express. But if you're not staying at a Disney resort, you can't use the Magical Express, right? Like, you have to be at the... Somebody said Uber is $30. Okay. Here we go. Live fact-checking right fact now. Checking. Here we go. Uh, why can't I... Here we go. Come on. Uber. Uber I don't Uber. know who's Java or Uber. Uvu Dropper. Uvu <laughs> Dropper. <laughs> okay. Um, Mir's transportation is almost a hundred dollars for three people. Wow. Um, Dream Disney three hundred and sixty says I would love to meet you and film you on rides with my camera. I have. Sorry, I went by too quick. So you have an on ride video for your YouTube. Oh, gotcha. Um, we appreciate the offer, oh. but we just we have no idea where we're gonna be like when you're in town. So we we definitely can't, um, you know, say that we could do it because we don't know if we're gonna be here or where we will be. But we do appreciate the offer. That is very very nice. Um, and we do hope you have an awesome time while you're in the parks for sure. And we have a uh, we have a 360 camera. Do we? Yeah. Oh. We just have never used it because. Oh, I didn't even know we had one. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so it's a 3866. Oh, that's from not bad. Okay. The airport to ticket and transportation center. I really thought it was um, going to be way more than that. Oh wait, can I not? Okay, yeah. Most hotels have a shuttle service, so yeah, look into that as well. See if your hotel or resort has a shuttle service before you go spending the money, because maybe maybe you do. Um, the so driver this, had a karaoke machine in their uh, Uber car. That sounds like um, cash cab. So this next one is from Tracy and Rhonda, and they're from Kansas. My husband and I, wait, am I wrong? Did I read that wrong? 
Is that what does that say? It says greetings from Kansas. No, what is that name and that name? I think it says Tracy and Rhonda. Okay, I just wanted to make sure I wasn't saying it wrong. Um, Sorry, they stamped over it at the. Yeah, they they do the stamp on the postcards and always where people write their name, and so I never can read any of it. Um, I've been watching your channel for a long while. We had the pleasure of meeting Tim at studios in October. Thank you for your kindness. I enjoyed your tour of the contemporary. That's my dream stay. We are headed your way in December. Well, thank you so much. And this is the, because they're from Kansas. Oh, yeah. I like, I like that. that. That's cool. Theming. I love it. Um, well, we hope you guys have an awesome time. While you guys are here, and you're going to be here at a really good time because it's Christmas time. Um, but yeah, and we hope you get to stay at the Contemporary. Yeah. I want to stay there one day, but I don't really think we could probably ever afford that because it's. We looked at the prices, and I think it's like eight hundred dollars a night. Oh yeah. Which is crazy. <laughs> yeah. I I can't imagine spending that much. Somebody said uh, the they wanted to know what camera we use for the live vlog, and this is. It's a Logitech HD 960, I think. Uh -oh. I think that's, or 920. I think that's what it's called. Patrick says, hey, wanted to know your top three resorts for couples at Disney. Just got into your vids and have been, and have been loved watching. Hope to see you at HHN this year. Top three resorts for couples at Disney. Where are you going? Bye. Oh, wait, where's he going now? I don't know. Santa, where are you going? In it. What are you doing, buddy? We might have to um, do the rest of these next oh, week. Oh, going to lay down in the bedroom. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Um, where did we stay? We stayed at the Portofino. No, we stayed at the Port Orleans Riverside. Yeah. And the room itself was actually dirty when we checked in. Right. But when they fixed that and we they like cleaned up our room, it was it was a nice room. Yeah. And the resort itself was they had a lot of coupley things to do at the resort. Like they had um carriage rides and yeah. um, stuff like that. Like just stuff where you can yeah. in like the boat rides and things. So I like that. Port Orleans Riverside is good for couples. That's what somebody said. Uh, this one is from Chris. Hi, Tim and Jen. Big fan yeah. since you guys started. Thank I you. I hope you receive this and wish you well. If you ever plan to come to Oregon, I will gladly give you a tour. And I like the beaver on the front of the organ <laughs> thing. Oh, and it just says who beef. That's awesome. This next one is from Shelby. Uh, says, love you guys. Shout out to... Oh, it's not Shelby. What is it? Shelby? That's, that's their mom. Oh, so Shelby. But what is it? What is it? Sherry. Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm having Mercury retrograde brain. Oh, no. Uh, love you guys. Shout out to Sherry, my mom, and me. Love you guys. Keep up the good work. What's your favorite ride in each of the parks? Oh, hi, guys. This is my second time riding you guys. Love you guys. By the way, my name is Shelby. Thank you. Thank you. And it's from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Um, All right, favorite so... ride in each park? Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't know. Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. Flight of Passage. Yeah. Dinosaurs. Flight, I think Flight of Passage. Well, I don't know. Mm, that's a hard one. I think Flight of Passage. Big Thunder or Haunted Mansion. Big Thunder for me. And, and what's the last part? Epcot. Magic. Epcot. Oh, uh, Epcot. Uh, Soren Test Track. Oh, we haven't even been on Test Track. And I wanted to ride Test Track, and you were like, what do you want to ride Test Track? I didn't say that. Yes, you, you did. You made up these stories about <laughs> No, me. you literally did. You go, you want to ride Test Track? And I was like, yeah, we're right here. Let's ride it. And you were like, okay. And then we, and then rode, we rode Frozen for the 15 millionth time. <laughs> That's what we did. I like Spaceship Earth. <laughs> oh, me too. I do too. Shout out to Jude. Um, all right. So here's what we're going to do. Because it has been about two hours, and um, I think we probably need to take Bandit out, which is why he was yeah. running around. Um, we're going to save. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... I think that's it. We have about seven more things that we need to open. I'm going to do this very last one, and we're going to save the other seven for next week. 
So I apologize. Um, we just it, we don't we don't have any more time. I'm really sorry, but we will open those next Tuesday, and we will also have another giveaway next Tuesday, yeah. and we will also be mailing out the three prizes that still need to be mailed out on Tuesday as well. So yes, um, so that's what's going to happen. I'm sorry, you guys, to cut it kind of short, even though it's not short, it's long. Yeah, it was two hours long. <laughs> but I feel like I'm cutting it short. So this says. Wishing you an exciting Easter. And he has like little hair, little Healthy egg hair. hair. Egg <laughs> hair. And so this is from Julie and Paul. And they say, happy Easter. Eat chocolate and have fun. Nice. From Julie and Paul. Thank and we you. did. We had we ate some chocolate and we had some fun. So thank you. Yeah. Um, all right. So, oh, hold on. I'm doing this wrong. There we go. I love this paper. It's so cute. Whoa. Wait, I don't open it yet. It's a I already opened it. Okay. Well, it was supposed to be a surprise. I didn't see it yet. Um, we came to Disney. Oh, sorry, we came to Orlando five years ago and experienced their first HHN. And now they're hooked. And they've been back every year since. And they're coming back this September. And they love watching our vlogs to give them ideas of like other things that they should do. They're hoping to go to Top Golf and to the Marceline to Magic Kingdom tour as they looked really fun. That was one thing is I wish I had done the Marceline tour. Yeah. Like, I wish I had gotten to do that. It looked really cool. We heard that you like to collect the You Are Here mugs and wanted to send you one from where we live in Manchester. No. No, we'll show it now. Don't look. Why? This is a surprise. No. Oh. <laughs> oh. Cadbury creme eggs. Yum. Can I eat one now? Yeah, that's by hand. There's only two of them. Oh, good. I love chocolate. Manchester. It's so cool. As you can see, it oh, is by the sea. I didn't know that there was a, a big guitar. I don't think there is a big guitar. I think that that's just like signifying Manchester's rock and roll. You're telling me that they don't have a huge soccer ball either? I don't think so. Well, I saw one right here. They might have... Um, what is what is this? Is this Big Ben? Where's Big Ben's in London, right? What's the what's this what's this big building in Manchester? Well. This one right here. That's where the queen lives. Queen doesn't live in Manchester. How do you know? Because <laughs> doesn't she live in London? Oh my god. These are so much better than ours. Are they? Yes, it's real sugar. Oh. I don't think if you guys like have come to America and tasted our chocolate and how terrible it is, and then when you guys send us like other countries' chocolates and it has actual sugar in it. Please don't send us chocolate. Yeah, don't actually, because we're trying not to be so um, chunky. But this is so good. Mm, Oasis. Yeah. Oh. Is that is this the Wonder Wall right there? <laughs> no, it's this one. That's the Wonder Wall. Said maybe. I don't really want to go. You're going to be the one that saves me. I like how we sang two different songs. <laughs> Can I have some of that water? Because after all... It's all gone? It was, and I saved one last sip for you. Mm. Because I'm a champagne supernova mm -hmm. in the sky. Manchester has a canal. Nice. That's the football ground? Thank you, Emily. You're a cutie. The big building is the <laughs> football ground? Wait, so what they said was... Please don't send us cream eggs. No, they're so good, though. Oh, my gosh. Um, we heard that you like to like the mugs. Thank you for the mug. It's very cool. And yeah, I, I like do it. like it a lot. Some of the things that it shows are the tallest building. Oh, that's that's the guitar. That's the Beatham Tower. That's this one. How do you say that? Beatham? Beatham? Beatham. Is that what it is? Tower. The town hall. Our round you know library. Town hall. Oh, there's the library right there. Um, the guitar is because uh, Manchester is well known for music. Yeah. And we hope to add to your collection. Thank you for your daily vlogs, which keep us going until our next visit. And we hope to bump into you. Love, Julie and Paul. Say hello to Bandit. Hi, Bandit. Um, they like when he plays with his squeaky toys. Oh, no. He's been, he's been playing a lot lately. And honestly, like, it makes me, I, I don't want to cry, but it, like, makes me so happy that he is, he's so active right now. Yeah, and it's he hasn't always been that way since he was diagnosed with cancer, and so it's any time that he wants to play, I'm like just like yes, let's play. <laughs> like, yeah, 
So, um, so I'm glad you like that he likes to play because it makes me happy. And they said diets don't count after Easter, so we've included some small chocolates in the mug. Oh no! Thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> happy Happy birthday to Brenda Lee! Happy birthday, Triado. Uh, have you guys ever tried to look into Disney Vacation Club? It might help with the, the stay. You get a free tour too. Here's the thing: uh, um, I don't want to sit through one of those like um, spiels because I feel like I would then buy into DVC. Yeah, we don't need to buy into DVC. I'd be like, we gotta do this. Yeah, we don't need to. That's such a great idea. It's a bad idea for it's, us. Well, it's a bad idea for us, but it's a great idea for other people. Vegemite challenge, no. It's so <laughs> gross. <laughs> no. Please don't. No. And thank you to Disney Dream 360. Yeah, thank you. Danny Elliott, birthday Sunday. Oh, happy birthday. Yeah. Uh, how crazy are the park? Right, right now? now? Pretty crazy. Yeah, it's pretty busy right now. Can I see Bandit? He's no, he, he just went over and went to sleep in the other room. I'll tweet a picture of him out after this. If you guys are on Twitter and you follow me, you can see it there. But I just don't want to like wake him up if he's sleeping right now. Yeah. What does the queen do all day? She cooks in queens. <laughs> right? That's pretty funny. That is funny. I like it. Uh, Jen, your voiceover lip reading of Tim was amazing. Thank you. I, it was really funny because I literally, when I put the clip in the computer, I was like, really? Like, why doesn't this have any audio? What am I going to do? I'm going to have to delete this. And then the other clip won't make any sense. And then I thought, well, I guess I could just try to figure out what he was saying. And it was actually really fun. <laughs> so it ended up being a fun thing and not an, an annoying thing, which was cool. That was from a movie. Is your toe still doing good? My toe where my toenail fell off in the live show that one time? Oh. Who remembers that? Shout out to like live show number five. I know it really was like our fifth one. And it was when I was training for the 10K. And after the 10K, my toenail fell off. Oh, no. <laughs> Which apparently happens to runners. But I'm a runner. So um, I was a little bit surprised by it. Somebody... Um... <laughs> Somebody said something. Oh no, your toenail fell out on a night out. Like it, you're <laughs> like you were out at the uh Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but I'm just like that would be so embarrassing. Mm -hmm. One time, okay, here's the thing. I've lost toenails before. That wasn't the first toenail that I've lost, but one time I lost my big toenail. Um I don't remember why. Oh, you know what it was? It was when those platform like Louboutins were super in style and all those platform heels were like a big deal. And so I bought a pair of platform heels that did not fit me because they were on sale. And I was like, I'm going to wear these. They're on sale. I have to buy them. Excuse me. So I wore them and they were so tight. It was rubbing my big toenail for all night. So my mm -hmm. big toenail fell off. So in order to have like a normal looking foot, I had to buy fake big toe, like fake toenails, <laughs> like acrylic nails, but like for toes, I still have it actually. <laughs> so I did. I had fake toenails for a little bit. Dang. Yeah. And they were beautifully, like, they were perfect. And it made me want to have always have fake toenails. She said she left the club, looked down, and was like, where's my toenail? <laughs> <laughs> it didn't hurt at all or bleed. Happy Which birthday. Like be, yeah. Happy birthday to Allison tomorrow. Happy birthday. You're making my toes feel weird. I'm well, sorry. It's just what happens to girls and runners, I guess. Shout out to Skylar and Madison. Do I still have? Yeah, I still have the toenail. The kit. fake toenail. Not I, don't, the, I don't have not the real toenail that fell off. No, no, no. I just have the kit, the fake toenail kit, still, just in case it happens again. You just did never you, know. <laughs> did you ever ride if you had wings? Yes, it was fun. I liked World of Motion better, but I have I did ride if you have wings. I feel like I rode it and don't remember it. Yeah. <laughs> Beauty <laughs> is pain. Notice me, PayPal. Walk me, PayPal. But. I don't know. <laughs> and you have okay toenails, and you run a 10K every day? Maybe you have good shoes, because maybe that was my problem, was my shoes. <laughs> um, uh, have you been to Sci-Fi Dine-In? Any suggestions? Yeah. I feel like their burger was pretty good. I had their Reuben, and it was good. There was something that was bad. Oh, no, was my their... burger was bad. Was it? Yeah, it was like a weird... Something that was it was like their special burger and it was bad. I don't remember it. I do remember that we ordered their fried pickles because we love fried pickles yeah, and, and those they were bad. were bad. Yeah. They're spears, so they were kind of like mushy. Yeah. Yeah. 
We but, have eaten at Mythos, and it's good. Yeah, but there was another time that we went to drive in, and it was good. Yeah, it's it was not... just this one burger was don't get their special burger, whatever it was. <laughs> And probably don't get their fried pickles because they're not like normal. Or get yeah. them if you I don't know. I don't like If you them. like soggy fried pickles, yeah. get them. Reuben is the best sandwich ever. Yes. I do. I love turkey Reubens. I get that pretty much everywhere that we go. Jen made us patty melts tonight. And they oh, were so they were from. Good. It was from Blue Apron. If any of you guys get Blue Apron, the patty melt deal meal dinner. You can use Mercury Retrograde. <laughs> it's really effective. It affects me. your communication <laughs> skills. Yeah. Um, it was so good, though. It was really good. Uh, I got my shirt <laughs> at Shop Disney. Yes, there's Lost so Boys. much. There's a lot of cool stuff on um on Shop the Shop Disney. Disney or whatever. I like, uh, yeah, I'm always in their new arrivals area. I like stock the new arrivals. Yeah. Oh, and we're getting a uh, a purple wall magic band eventually. Okay, we ordered this purple wall magic band to give away to you guys like a month ago yeah. when it when it came out when it was like still a big thing and now they painted the wall and it's not even the purple wall anymore yeah it's like the purple wall 2.0 right so sorry. so i guess it's like a collector's item now maybe <laughs> I don't know. Uh, what is the tower of terror challenge we already did the tower of terror challenge in like 2011 and we just rode tower of terror 13 times in a row and it was so bad it made me sick it was hard yeah, yeah. And we had to wait in line every time. So we were there for like, I think it was 12 hours yes. riding that ride. <laughs> Sailor Mercury Retrograde sounds like Sailor Moon Attack. Ooh. Would you ever get a cat? Um, we Our neighbors had a cat that sort of like lived in our yard. And we loved her so much. Her name was Abby. And then they moved and they took her. And it was so sad. Yeah. And I just don't think that there's a cat that's like her. So I, would, I wouldn't be able to replace her. Yeah. What is this? Oh, hey, the Disney Double Dose is in here. Hello. The new wall is apparently called the Galactic Purple Wall. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, there I you don't, go. I don't hate the new wall. I do think it looks pretty. Like, I think yeah. what they did is, is pretty. But I just wish that they had mailed out the Purple Wall magic bands before they changed it. <laughs> That's right. all. And the whole reason that I bought it was because it was silly. And I figured yeah, maybe it was you guys would like want a, it as a giveaway. Yeah. And then it never came. Yeah. This is a Jen heavy episode. Hi, Josh. Oh, <laughs> Josh. You are on vacation. You shouldn't be watching us. You should be having fun on vacation. Right? And isn't it like it's 13 hours ahead of us right now? Did you just wake up? Yeah. What time is it over there? Are you Jeez, going? Oh, shout out to Tina and Jean. Hi, oh, Tina yeah. and Jean. Say we hello have... to Bob and, and Linda for us. We have eaten at Mythos. Um, and I think it's. In the title of the video, so if you search the Tim Tracker Mythos, it should pop up. We're drinking and waiting oh. for Sumo. Oh, is that today? Yeah. Nice. That's exciting. That is exciting. Have you, I've seen you hang out with Patrick Dougal in the past. Yeah, we have. Um, we actually, if you go on my channel, the, what is it called? Skitty Skitty Bang Bang, my old, old, old channel. Um, we have a Rugrats parody where he plays Chucky. And he was in like a ton of our old old videos when he still lived here. Yeah, and if you go and if you search our channel for Warner Brothers Studio Tour, he oh yeah, on the tour of the Warner Brothers lot. So. We we visited him. I think we saw him both times that we were out there. Not least, the we last saw him time. once at Knotts. That's right. Yeah, we saw him at Knotts. Yeah. yeah, I did the right thing by choosing Animal Kingdom Lodge as my hotel. Yes, I think you did the right thing. It's a really nice hotel. Yeah. How soft is what? <laughs> um, holler to Henry Cooper. Oh, geez, it went by Henry and Cooper, hollering. Holla. Holla. Shout out to Emmy in Montana. Oh yeah, Stacy, you're right. Okay, she said we love watching you, but you better take Bandit out. And yes, ah, okay. Thank you for reminding us. Um, we still have seven packages to open and a couple of cards. No, we did the cards. Um, no, there are two cards and a couple of packages left open. So we will open those next Tuesday, and we will also be giving away these ears next Tuesday, um, and we will be mailing out the last three giveaway items Tuesday. So, yes. um, so thank you guys for coming and hanging out, and sorry it was so long. <laughs> yes. So, uh, happy night. What? Good night. <laughs> okay. Good night, everybody. We love you guys. We um, will see you guys on Tuesday, hopefully. And we'll see you tomorrow with a new video for sure. Yeah, and thanks for, thanks for hanging out.
thank you for yeah thanks for coming i don't know i don't know how to end this oh well bye. we're doing it we're, we're live forever <laughs> all right bye everybody bye guys